Imagine a drone so powerful it can fly for over 30 hours straight, carry heavy weapons, and strike deep into enemy territory, all without risking a single pilot's life. This is the IAI Heron, TP, Israel's long-range combat UAV, and today we're going inside its secret capabilities to see why it's changing the future of modern warfare. Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel! Today, we're diving deep into one of the most advanced unmanned aerial vehicles in the world, the IAI Heron TP, also known as the Eaton. This massive UAV is not just a reconnaissance tool, but a fully capable combat platform that represents Israel's cutting edge military innovation. Developed by Israel Aerospace Industries, the Heron TP is designed to provide long endurance surveillance, intelligence gathering, and even strike capabilities over hostile territories. Unlike smaller drones, the Heron TP is in a league of its own due to its enormous wingspan, heavy payload capacity, and advanced technology. In fact, it's one of the largest UAVs in operation today, almost comparable in size to a small manned aircraft. What makes this drone stand out is its ability to operate at high altitudes, carry precision guided munitions, and provide critical real-time data to commanders on the ground. In today's video, we'll break down its design technology, weapon systems, and strategic importance, and by the end, you'll understand why militaries around the world are closely watching Israel's drone program. So let's get started with its design and physical features. The first thing you notice about the Heron TP is its sheer size. With a wingspan of 26 meters, similar to a Boeing 737, it is one of the largest UAVs in the world. Its length is about 14 meters, and it stands tall with a height of nearly 4.6 meters. This size gives it an impressive payload capacity of around 1,000 kilograms, which is significantly more than most drones in service today. Built with composite materials, the drone balances strength with lightweight durability, allowing it to stay airborne for extended missions. The Heron TP is powered by a Pratt & Whitney PT6A turboprop engine, capable of producing over 200 horsepower. This allows it to reach speeds of up to 220 knots, or around 400 kilometers per hour. The UAV is also designed to operate at altitudes exceeding 45,000 feet, putting it well out of reach of most surface-to-air threats. Its size not only allows for greater endurance, but also the flexibility to carry multiple types of payloads, ranging from surveillance sensors to precision guided weapons. This adaptability is one of the biggest reasons the Heron TP has become a centerpiece in Israel's UAV arsenal. Endurance is one of the defining features of the Heron TP. This drone can stay in the air for more than 30 hours, conducting long-range surveillance or strike missions without needing to refuel. Such endurance gives Israel a significant advantage in intelligence gathering, as the Heron TP can loiter over a target area for extended periods, waiting for the perfect opportunity to strike or collect data. Unlike manned aircraft, which are limited by pilot fatigue, UAVs like the Heron TP can operate continuously, providing a persistent presence over areas of interest. This capability is particularly useful for monitoring hostile activities, tracking enemy movements, or protecting borders. The long flight endurance also allows the drone to cover vast distances, making it suitable for operations not just in Israel's immediate neighborhood, but also far beyond. In fact, the Heron TP has been used in missions as far away as Arn and Sudan, demonstrating its strategic reach. When combined with satellite communications, the drone can be controlled from thousands of kilometers away, making it a truly global asset. This unmatched endurance makes the Heron TP an essential tool for both surveillance and strike operations in today's complex battlefields. One of the key strengths of the Heron TP is its advanced sensor suit. The UAV is equipped with electro-optical infrared cameras, synthetic aperture radar, maritime patrol radars, 
and signals intelligence equipment, these sensors give it the ability to see in all weather conditions, day or night, and detect targets hidden under foliage, camouflage, or even inside buildings. The synthetic aperture radar allows it to generate high resolution images of terrain and moving targets, which is crucial for identifying enemy bases, missile sites, or armored vehicle movements. It's electro-optical and infrared systems can lock onto targets with precision, providing the guidance needed for accurate strikes. Additionally, the drone's communication systems allow it to relay live video feeds and intelligence data directly to command centers, giving commanders real-time situational awareness. This seamless flow of information ensures that decisions can be made quickly and accurately, whether it's for launching a strike, directing ground forces, or intercepting a threat. The combination of endurance and advanced sensors means the Heron TP can act as both a surveillance hub and a strike platform, making it one of the most versatile UAVs in service today. The Heron TP is not just a surveillance drone, it is also capable of carrying and deploying advanced weaponry with its large payload capacity. The UAV can be fitted with precision guided munitions such as air to surface missiles, glide bombs, and laser guided weapons. This transforms it from a passive observer into an active combat asset capable of neutralizing high value targets with pinpoint accuracy. Unlike traditional airstrikes that require manned fighter jets, the Heron TP can perform the same mission without putting pilots in harm's way. It can loiter over the battlefield, identify targets through its sensors, and strike at the right moment. Its weapon systems are integrated with its intelligence, gathering capabilities, ensuring that strikes are precise and minimize collateral damage. This makes it ideal for counter-terrorism operations, eliminating enemy leadership or destroying hidden weapons caches. Furthermore, its ability to remain airborne for hours after a strike means it can assess battle damage and continue monitoring the situation. The Heron TP represents the future of unmanned combat, where drones are no longer limited to reconnaissance, but are full, fledged strike platforms capable of shaping the battlefield on their own. Operational history gives us a clear picture of how effective the Heron TP is in real world scenarios. The drone entered service with the Israeli Air Force in 2010 and has since been involved in numerous missions. One of its most significant uses has been in long range surveillance operations over hostile territories. Reports suggest that it has been deployed for monitoring Iran's nuclear sites and tracking weapons smuggling routes in Sudan. In Gaza, the Heron TP has been used extensively for both intelligence and precision strikes, playing a crucial role in Israel's counter-terrorism operations. Its ability to loiter for long periods makes it perfect for urban environments where identifying high-value targets can take hours or even days. Outside Israel, the Heron TP has also been exported to countries such as Germany, India, and Azerbaijan, where it has been used for reconnaissance and border patrol missions. Each of these nations values the UAV's endurance, payload capacity, and versatility in dealing with modern security challenges. The operational history of the Heron TP highlights not only its technological strengths, but also its reliability in some of the most challenging environments around the world. A major reason for the Heron TP's success lies in its advanced autonomy and control systems. While it can be operated remotely by ground controllers, it also has semi-autonomous features that allow it to take off, navigate, and land without direct human input. This reduces the workload on operators and minimizes the risk of human error during critical moments. The UAV is equipped with satellite communication links, giving it beyond line of sight capabilities. This means it can be controlled from command centers thousands of kilometers away, extending Israel's reach far beyond its borders. 
The drone is also capable of integrating into larger network centric warfare systems, sharing its data with other drones, fighter jets, and ground units in real time. This creates a seamless flow of information across the battlefield, ensuring that all forces have a clear picture of the situation. Additionally, the Heron TP has built in redundancy systems, including backup communication links and navigation aids, making it highly reliable even in contested environments where electronic warfare might be used against it. These autonomous and network capabilities make the Heron TP not just a standalone asset, but a critical part of Israel's broader defense ecosystem. The Heron TP plays a vital role in Israel's defense doctrine, which heavily relies on advanced technology to maintain a qualitative military edge. Surrounded by adversaries and facing constant threats, Israel needs tools that can provide both early warning and rapid response. The Heron TP fits this requirement perfectly, acting as both an eye in the sky and a long range strike platform. Its ability to operate far beyond Israel's borders allows it to project power and deter potential adversaries. Moreover, it reduces the risk to Israeli pilots by replacing manned missions with unmanned alternatives. This shift toward UAV-based warfare also reflects a broader global trend where drones are becoming central to modern militaries. Israel, being one of the pioneers in drone technology, uses the Heron TP not just as a tactical asset, but also as a strategic one, giving it the ability to strike enemies at a distance while keeping its own forces safe. The drone's importance in Israel's security doctrine cannot be overstated. It ensures surveillance dominance, precision strike capability, and long-range deterrence, all of which are vital for a nation that operates in such a volatile region. Comparing the Heron TP with other global UAVs highlights just how advanced this system is in terms of size and endurance. It competes directly with the American MQ-9 Reaper, which is considered the gold standard of combat drones. However, the Heron TP's payload capacity and operational ceiling give it an edge in some areas, while the Reaper has been combat proven in conflicts across the Middle East and Afghanistan. The Heron TP has carved its niche by focusing on long-range surveillance and strategic strike missions. Another comparison can be made with China's Winglung drones, which are cheaper but less advanced in terms of endurance, payload, and sensor quality. The Heron TP is built not just for tactical strikes, but for strategic operations, giving it a unique advantage in intelligence heavy warfare. Moreover, Israel's expertise in electronic warfare and sensor technology makes its UAVs highly competitive on the global market. While the United States may dominate in numbers, the Heron TP represents a unique blend of endurance, payload, and precision that few other drones can match. It's not just another UAV, it's a strategic weapon system that rivals the very best in the world. Looking ahead, the future of the Heron TP looks even more promising. Israel is continuously upgrading the drone with new technologies, including artificial intelligence, swarming capabilities, and improved electronic warfare systems. These upgrades aim to make the UAV even more autonomous, allowing it to identify and strike targets with minimal human involvement. There are also discussions about integrating it with next generation weapons, including hypersonic missiles and directed energy systems. Additionally, the Heron TP is expected to play a larger role in joint operations, working alongside other drones, manned aircraft, and even naval vessels, as warfare continues to evolve toward unmanned and AI-driven platforms the Heron TP will remain at the forefront of this revolution. Its combination of endurance, payload, and precision strike capabilities makes it not just relevant today, but also a key player in the conflicts of tomorrow. For Israel, it ensures continued dominance in the UAV sector, while for the rest of the world, it serves as a benchmark of what modern unmanned combat systems should be capable of achieving 